This video presentation is represented by electrical4u.com, an online electrical engineering study site. Let us discuss about zinc carbon battery. This was first experimentally demonstrated by French scientist Georges Leclanché. This is known as Leclanché cell, and it was invented and patented by him in 1866. In this battery cell, one glass jar was used as main container. The container was filled with ammonium chloride solution as electrolyte. In this battery cell, a porous pot was filled with one-to-one -one mixture of manganese dioxide and carbon powder. A carbon rod was inserted into this mixture. The porous pot along with this mixture and carbon rod served as positive electrode or cathode and this was placed in the ammonium chloride solution in the jar. A zinc rod was immersed in this electrolyte as negative electrode, or anode. In the clanch battery cell, zinc is used as anode, manganese dioxide is used as cathode and ammonium chloride is used as electrolyte. During discharge, zinc anode involves in oxidation reaction, and each zinc atom, involved in this reaction releases two electrons. That is, Zn becomes Zn2 plus and two electrons these electrons come to the cathode through external load circuit. In the clanch battery cell, ammonium chloride exists in electrolyte mixture as NH4 plus and Cl minus ions. In cathode, manganese dioxide will be reduced to Mn2O3 in reaction with ammonium ion. In addition to Mn2O3 this reaction also produces ammonia and water. Overall reaction is Zn plus 2MnO2 plus 2NH4Cl equals Mn2O3 plus Zn within bracket NH3 2 Cl2 plus H2O. Standard voltage rating of a zinc carbon battery is determined by type of anode and cathode materials used in the battery cell. In zinc carbon battery cell, Zinc is anode material and manganese dioxide is cathode material. Electrode potential of zinc is minus 0.76 volt whereas electrode potential of manganese dioxide is 1.23. Therefore, theoretical voltage of each cell should be minus minus 0.76 plus 1.23 equals 1.99 V but considering many practical conditions, the actual voltage output of a standard zinc carbon battery is not more than 1.5 volt. Thank you. Hope you got a clear and basic idea. So, please do not forget to watch more technical video presentation, and many more, in electrical4u.com.